Welcome to this DaVinci Resolve Fusion node breakdown. Today's node, not so much of a node, we're going to be talking about groups. And uh, I know this is a node breakdown, but an important part of using nodes is using the, the flow organizational nodes within Fusion. But they're not really nodes. So we're going to jump into Fusion and we've got this little uh, composition going and it's just a... Uh, Simple little MIDI end with a Delta key, here. some uh, text nodes going on, all merged together to uh, give us this little look. So in creating our nodes, they can get a lot more complex and your node trees can start getting all kind of crazy. So what we really want to do is we want to group some of this stuff together that we can group. And the easy way to do that well, the one way to do it is select which node. So let's say we want all these text nodes with its multi-merge and the transform all grouped together into one little text group. I can either hit control G or I can right click and uh, select group. And it's going to group all those nodes together in one single group. And if I need to see them again, I can double click and look at my little group and if i hit x it'll close them back up now if we look at our group if you notice what it did is it created an automatic output of our group so if we move all our nodes in here around it's still going to be connected to our output but i can't remove these nodes and change well i can change i can add more nodes in here if i wanted to i can add a, another transform and i can still edit but honestly to maintain the integrity of your inputs and outputs, it's better just to right click, select, ungroup, make your changes, reselect it, hit control G or right click and select group. Now, once we have a group, we can uh, hit F2 to uh, rename them. So we can rename this group to uh, text nodes so now our little group is renamed so if we close this you can see we've got our nodes renamed additionally we can change the color of our little line on our nodes we can right click set color we can do our bright lime if we want so we've got a new color but notice this doesn't actually change the color of our little group area like it does within our little underlay that we created but if you really wanted a uh, color when you open this up you could select all these shift space select underlay and you've got a little underlay in there that uh, we can now go set our color to our ugly line and we can close that up now when we're talking about the outputs it automatically creates here it's going to do that for whatever uh, inputs and outputs you have. So like if I took these merge nodes that I have our footage merged into, select them, hit control G. If we look at our little group, you can see we've got multiple inputs on our little group here. If I double click it and we zoom in to kind of see what's happening, you can see it connected all of our nodes correctly within our little group. So that is the group node, not necessarily node. That's using groups within Fusion. I will see you in the next node breakdown.